Hello students, my name is Vineet and welcome to our lesson school. Today we are going to discuss class 4th EVS chapter number 12 that is changing times. The summary of this chapter is Chetan Das has to move India from Pakistan when he was of 9 year age. He was very sad because he has to leave his friends, his places and lots of family there. After coming to India, Chetan and his family has to spend some days in camps. After that his father got a piece of land where they made a house which was just like the older one. So that's it from the summary. Now let's move on to question and answer. Page number 98. Find out and write. Question 1. Talk to any of your grandparents or some elderly people. Find out when she was of 8 or 9 year old. Where did she or he live? The answer is she live in a hut in a village. 2. From what material was her or his house made? The answer is her or his house was made of bamboo, mud, wood, straw, etc. 3. Did she or he have a toilet in her house? The answer is no, they do not have toilet in their house. 4. In which part of the house was food cooked? The answer is there was a separate kitchen. 5. A lot of mud was used when Chetan Das house was made. Why? Answer is mud helps to keep the house cool in summer and warm in winter. At page number 100. Question 2. Chetan Das tells that people from outside the house used to come to clean the toilets and take away the waste. They are not allowed to enter the house. The people who used to toilet did not clean them. Discuss. Answer. People who used to do the toilets do not clean it. They think this is a dirty job. Question 3. Is there a toilet in your house? Who cleans it? Answer is yes, we have a toilet in our house. We clean it ourselves. At page number 101. Question 4. What material have been used in making your house? Answer is cement, sand, bricks, tiles, wood, iron, rods, etc. have been used in making my house. Question 5th. Find out the material from which your friend's house is made. Is there any difference? Write about it. Answer is my friend's house is made of cement, sand, brick, stone, marble, iron, wood, etc. Their house has marble on the floor. Question 6. What kind of house do you think Chetan Das grandchildren will live in? Answer is they live in a cemented house. Page 102. Question number 7. Where would you like to live when you grow up? What kind of house would you like? The answer is I would like to live in my own native place. I would like to live in a pakka house. Question 8. You had written about the things that your grandparents' house was made of. Have some of those materials been used in your house? Name them. And the answer is yes. What is used in my house as well as in my grandparents' house? Question number 9. In your place, what do you call a person who works with wood? Answer. A person who works with wood is called as carpenter. Question 10. Now look at the picture and fill in the table. What kind of work are different people doing? What tools are they using? Answer. Tools, electric wires, screw, drivers, person called electrician, pipe cutter plier, person called plumber, cement, sand, etc. person called mason. At page number 103, question number 11. With your teacher or someone from home go to place where a building is being constructed. Talk to the people working there and find out the answer of these questions. 1. What is being built there? Answer is a house is being built there. Second, How many people are working there? The answer is about 20 people are working there. What kind of work are they doing? The answer is some people are fixing sand and cement. Some are carrying the mixture to another person. That person is placing bricks with the help of the mixture. And another person is cutting the wood to make during frames etc. Question number 4. What kind of tools are they using? Answer. They are using axe, drill, corny, spade etc. Four. Fifth. How many men and women are there? Answer is there are about 11 women and 9 men. At page number 104. Six. Are any children working there? What are they doing? Answer is no. There are no children working there. How many men do these people get daily? 
Ask for any three different people. Answer is a carpenter rupees 200, Mason rupees 200, and helper rupees 100. Eighth, where do these people live? Answer is they live in a tent near the building place. Ninth, what are the materials being used in making the building? Answer is wood, cement, iron, rod, bricks, sand, small stones, etc. are the material being used in the making the building. Tenth, try and guess how many trucks of bricks and bags of cement will be used for making this building. Answer is 50 bags of cement and 3 trucks of bricks will be used for making this building. Question number 12. How does the material reach the building place? The answer is all material reach the building place by truck, tramp, etc. Question 13. Find out the price of 1 bag of cement, rupees 210, 1 brick, rupees 3, one truck of sand rupees 4000 at page number 105 question number 14 ask a few other questions and write their answers 1 how much sand is mixed with cement the answer is 4 bag of sand is mixed with 1 bag of cement second why is iron rod used the answer is it makes the building strong 15 over the 60 years different material were used at different times in Chetanda's house. List these in correct order. The answer is this. So that's it from this video. I hope this video is really helpful to you all. Like this video and share it with your friends. And do not forget to subscribe to M School so that you will never miss the uh, another chapter we are going to make. We will be back with more such chapters. Till then, Tata students.